everyone, I'm back. This is the second video of my special giveaway series. So as a reminder, I posted a video earlier showing you guys some of the items that would be in my giveaway when I got to 75 subscribers. And as a reminder, what you need to do to participate in that giveaway is two things. First, you need to subscribe to my channel and let me know you subscribed. And, and the, the second thing is DM me the special phrase that I give out. So there are three videos and in each video, I'm going to give you a special word during that video. And all you have to do is send me what those three words are. That the giveaway will be worth more than 100 products. And I showed you guys in the first video what some of those will be. And I'm going to include, of course, a couple extra treats. So what is this second video? <laughs> Today is December 7th and I have not opened my Madam Glam Advent Calendar or my a, a Advent Calendar since December 2nd. I am so sorry you guys, I wanted to open this along with you, but because we have five days to open on each calendar, it's essentially a mini Christmas. So let's go ahead and get started. I don't want to make this super long because I know you guys are all watching to get that special world. Work world. I am all over the place with my vocabulary today. Sorry, you guys. Hopefully you get it. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start with the Madam Glam because I'm so excited about Madam Glam. So if you guys watched the first video, you know that this Madam Glam advent calendar is absolutely ginormous and gorgeous and awesome. And so far we got two things, which is the temperature changing gel polish. Um, it's called glow, but it's very, very pretty when it goes on. It's more of a summer color in my opinion, but as with any color, they can be worn year round. Who cares? You're the no second thing we got on December 2nd was a base coat. All right, guys. So let's open this bad boy up. And just a reminder, this is what it looks like on the inside. Woo, gorgeous. All right. Shall we take a guess of what this is? I'm going to, I think it's a top coat because December 2nd was a base coat. So let's see if I'm correct. And I was wrong as with everything, but surprise, this one has two items. Hello, Angela. All right, let's see what it is. Dumping them out. <gasps> Ooh, we have two ice blossom poly gels. Yeah, baby. So for anyone that doesn't know what poly gel is, poly gel is a method of enhancing your nail or making it longer. It is a mixture between a hard gel, which a hard gel has a more runny viscosity, and acrylic, which is obviously a powder and a liquid. So poly gel is a mixture between the two, does not cure until it goes into the lamp. So if you're new at doing nails or enhancing nails, poly gel is a great option because it gives you time to play with it and get that nail perfect before you cure it and put it under the light. And all you need is gel brush, which is one, the actual poly gel, and then alcohol. And you can sculpt the nail. Of course, you want to prep it and what have you, but really it's only three products. So this color is Ice Blossom, which I believe is clear. And I love working with clear for many reasons. One is because I can add any color to it and make it a color. So you can start with clear and basically make any color you want. Two, you can encapsulate glitters that are beautiful or mix the glitter with the poly gel before you apply it to the nail that have a glittered poly gel. I just love clear. There's so much that you can do with it. Sculpt the nail regular and, and paint over it with gel polishes you normally would. So I'm super excited about this. I primarily just use acrylic and hard gel, but this will be fun to play with. All right, guys, so that was December 3rd. So December 4th, what is it? So I was wrong on that one. Where's December 4th? Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is a weird shaped one. It's the skinniest little one in the bunch. I almost missed it, number four. What could this be? Is it a brush to play with that poly gel? I love brushes. I love brushes. It is. All right, guys. So I just talked about that poly gel brush, the gel brush, and now I'm going to be able to show you what it is. 
This is a poly gel brush. A lot of them on the market actually, woohoo, my bad, actually look like this. They have the same design. All right, so let's open this. Oh, I got purple hair on me. So let's open this bad boy up. All right, so this is the side of the brush that you work the poly gel with. So you'd put the poly gel on your nail. It always takes less than you think it takes. Use very, very little. You could probably sculpt 100 nails with this little tiny thing. It's You don't use as much as you think that you need. So start with little. You can always add more. And you put this in the alcohol. And uh, you work your poly gel to make a nail enhancement. The other side of this, which is very helpful and how you'll be able to identify if you're new to nails a poly gel brush is they have a paddle and what the paddle is for is to squeeze out your poly gel and actually uh cut it off and then apply it to the nail that's what the paddle's for so they're super handy brushes they're also good for mixing glitter mixing your hard gel if you want to put glitter in this or a color you put it out squirt what you need on um the back of a nail form or tile squeeze it out get your pigmentation your color or your glitter and you can mix it up right there pick it up and apply to your nail so very 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 useful tool that you should probably have in your salon or area no matter what so i'm excited that i actually got to tell you guys a little bit about poly gel and show you the brush that you're gonna need. You can find these on Amazon, probably around 10 bucks, or you can also get them on Madame Glam. All right, so we're still working on this advent calendar. We have, if that was the fourth, we have the fifth, the sixth, and the seventh. So let's keep opening up surprise gifts, shall we? All right, here's the fifth. Bam, got it, oops, bam. All right, let's see what this is. Ooh, hello, big mama. I like this. <gasps> we have another temperature changing gel polish and this one is awesome. Oh my God. People are going to love this. What's it called? It's called Shifter, which makes sense. Hema free. So for anyone who didn't watch my first video about Madam Glam. So they do have a line that's Hema free which is a product that's used in a lot of nail products, also a potential irritant or allergen. So if that product is touching your skin a lot, you can get contact dermatitis. And a lot of people are actually allergic to that. So you want to be very careful when you're painting your nails and you're using any type of nail product that you're not touching the skin. If you're cleaning the sides, what have you, don't do that because you're getting product on your skin. So if something like that happens, wash your hands right away. But uh, I don't know how I got into that. But vegan, cruelty-free, HEMA-free, and nine-free. So it's a, it's a good nail brand to use. I also like the fact that when you use these, it's usually opaque in one coat, which helps you keep the nails thin. The other thing, which I don't know if this bothers anyone, but it doesn't smell Sometimes like... Sometimes when you walk into a salon, there's a very, very strong chemical smell. This brand in particular smells actually pretty good. So I don't know if you should be sniffing it or what have you, but it kind of reminds me of bubble gum. I haven't smelled this particular one, but every time I open their gel polishes, I'm like, mmm, smells good. All right, so let's see. I don't want to waste you guys' time and... Ooh, hello. Check out that. Now that's a color. And I know someone is going to walk in here and ask for this. And when it goes under the light or when it gets warm or when you're washing your hands under warm water or taking a shower or what have you, it will turn white. So super cool. And sometimes if you put this on the natural nail, what's cool and you have a longer nail is that sometimes depending on how sensitive the temperature changing polish is, it'll almost look like a natural ombre because your nail bed is going to be warm because it's part of your body. Whereas the free edge that will be cooler. So it would look like, I don't know how sensitive this is yet. I haven't used it, but it will look like a natural ombre. Like you have white on the bottom and pink on the top, which is really cool. I really, or yeah, white on the bottom, pink on the top. So I'm excited to use this. And the name of this, if you want to go buy it, is Shifter. All right. So we have December 6th. Bounce, bam, wow. Bounce, 
Oh, here it is. I I mean, I'm okay with the fact that the numbers are all mixed up, but I'm having a hard time finding them today. Bam, number six. Let's see what this bad boy is, shall we? All right, guys. So, no wipe top gel. Yeah. So, so far, we got two temperature changing gels. We got two things of poly gel, clear poly gel. We got a poly gel brush and we got a top coat and base coat. So, so far, this is pretty good. And I needed one of these. I go through so much Madam Gel top coat. It's nuts because it is so shiny. I love it. And it's, of course, HEMA free, which I want to use on my, pro on my clients and I use on myself. All right. So number seven, that wasn't a super exciting one. No wipe top coat. If you don't do nails and you don't know what a no wipe top coat is, essentially when you use gel polish, every time you come out of the light, you're always going to have a sticky layer. That sticky layer on top is a, or a inhibition layer or a tacky layer is essentially gel polish that hasn't cured. So you always want to take a little alcohol and wipe off that tacky layer. Top coat is the same. The reason why nail techs like top coat is because when you apply it, you don't have that tacky layer on top. Now there's always a special place for a top coat that has a tacky, a tacky layer, like when you're applying glitter or you want a sticky top. But most of the time, if you're not putting anything on top of your top coat, we always want to go with a no wipe. So that's what a no wipe top coat is and that's what the difference is. It comes out without an inhibition layer or a tacky layer. And what's this? Oh, this is cool. A peel off base coat, which I actually didn't have from Madam Glam. So this is really good if you do your nails a lot and you're worried about damage to your natural nails. It'll peel right off. Must be cured under the LED light for 30 seconds. Off, So you won't have to sit there with tinfoil wrapped around for however long waiting for it to absorb. So super cool if you change your nails a lot. If you want to change your nails once a week or uh, you're just playing with nail art potentially and you want to get that bad boy off right away. All right. So we just did six. So this is the last one, you guys. But don't get sad. We got some kick butt stuff today. Where's number seven? Did someone steal number seven from me? Maybe I... Did I already open number seven? I got... That was four. I already opened number seven. Sorry, guys. That's it. So excited. All right. So we got the shifter, the poly gels, two poly gels, which is cool. We got the poly gel brush. You can find these on Amazon or Madam Glam, which I'll link below. We have the top coat, no wipe top coat. We have the peel off base coat. And then this is the one that we got before. You may hear some boxes falling. All right. A&A glitter biatches. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I just felt like I had to. a, &A glitter. All right. Where's number three? Let's see. They really like, these numbers are all over the place. That's the one thing, like, advent calendars are crazy because they just like, and these are really tight made for baby fingers. So. Ooh. Come on, come out. I just saw a little glimpse of you. Ooh. This is called Winter Spice Seasonal Mix. This is pretty. Hello. Look at that. So it's white. A little, it's very, very little bit of green, but it's primarily white and red with gold and a little bit of green. Did they put, this kind of reminds me of like, you know what this would look good with? A candy cane nail or a peppermint nail. And you know what? I lied. I didn't look at this mix before I showed it to you guys. There is no green in here. The gold, depending on how the light hits it, is um, kind of grabbing some green tones. This is beautiful. So it's matte white, uh, holographic red, and it's all different sizes. This is a true glitter mix. Of all three colors, there's different sizes of the gold, the red, and the white. I love this. This is pretty. And it's going to be very classic if you want to do a red set. That would look beautiful with it. All right. So number three, if you want to buy this, I don't know if it's available. I'm pretty sure that they put custom items in the advent calendar so that People don't get the same item twice, but this is called Winter Spice Seasonal Mix. And that, that name actually makes perfect sense. All right, number four. Oh, <laughs> I 
love this. This is called Jelly Beans. Wait till you see it. Oh my God, it's so cute. So cute. Jelly Beans. How cute is that? Oh my God, I'm so gonna be using this in the summer. Probably with Shifter or with Glow. This is so cute. So this is blue holographic. These are hexagon glitters, which are really, really fun to work with. So it has blue hexagon glitters, yellow hexagon glitters, and pink matte hexagon glitters. And the hexagons are all different sizes. So there's little baby hexagons, big hexagons, hexagons everywhere. And it's called Jelly Beans. This is so cute. I cannot wait to use this glitter. This is so cute. It's going to be so awesome during the summer. I love it. I love it. I actually think hexagon, I mean, jelly beans is my favorite so far. What do you guys think? Okay, so that was number four. Let's go number five. Where are you, number five? Number five, where are you? It's right here, found it. Oh, come out, drive me crazy. All right. Ooh, I like this one too. This is called Christmas Party Seasonal Mix. I love this. Oh my God. Talk about party. I, you know what? The camera's not doing it because there's too many holographic colors in here. Ooh. I don't even know if you can get it. There's a lot of silver, but there's also a fuchsia in here, like a hot pink, a deep dark purple, which is like the color in my hair. Gold. Is that a star? And they're round glitters, hexagon glitters. Bar glitters, there's silver bar glitters in here. This is a like a party glitter. This, there's round hexagon bars, all different glitter shapes. And then like the circle one that is hollow in the middle. This is gonna be a fun glitter. I may be putting this on my nails next. I don't know you guys, what do you think? If you have an opinion of what glitter I should put on my nails next, let me know in the comments below and I will do that. So this is called Christmas Party Seasonal Mix. So far, it's a toss up between Christmas Party Seasonal Mix and Jelly Beans. So let's see, that was number five and they keep, honestly, they keep getting better. So let's see what number six has in store. This is called Psychedelic Special Mix. Check mm, it out. Ooh, this is a neon version of Jelly Beans. I don't know if you guys can see it, it's so pretty. So the primary color is a is like this color. This is like the primary color in there. So it's a pinkish coral with, this actually is a great Easter mix, believe it or not, with a neon yellow, a pastel purple that's matte. Actually, most of them are matte in here, except for the little tiny circles. There's hexagons and circles. This looks a lot like jelly beans uh, with the different like pastel neon type thing. This is great for Easter. That was six, right guys? Was that six? Yep. So we have one more. One more. Seven. And then that's it. So what do we got? Come on. Come on, seven. Where are you? Jump out at me. Five, eight, eleven, seven. I'm opening it. And just a reminder, this is what it looks like. So let's get this out. See, I told you guys it was hard. And this is classic. And it looks like, so this is Noel and Noel. Gold, red, white. Let's open it up. Let's open Noel, Noel. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh, I really like the small, small, small circles in there. They look like snow. This is very, very pretty. We're gonna have to be using this on someone's nails. So it's again, matte white, which I love matte white glitters. I think they're gorgeous. I love all matte white to use in conjunction with a French or wedding nails. They are beautiful. We do have green in this, a green holographic. We have a red holographic and a gold holographic. So very, very pretty and it's circle and hexagons, all different sizes. And that's really what a mix is. A mix is a glitter that has all different size glitters in it, not just big chunky glitters, not just medium glitters, not just fine glitters. It really is a mix of all different sizes. So that's all we have for the advent calendars. 
So this is the ANA advent calendar. I don't know if they have any more in stock. I do happen to know that the Madam Glam advent calendar, they had it on sale like three days ago for 120 bucks at the time that I'm filming this. So that is less than the 150 that I paid. They're probably selling out pretty quick just because there's awesome products in here. I mean, if you think each one of these gel polishes is 20 bucks, I, I've already got 20, 40, 60, 80. I think the poly gels like for this size is maybe 10. I don't know where I'm pretty much at the amount of products that I've paid. It's only December 7th. All right, guys, I hope you liked this video. So the special word is bananas, all right? So the first video, I gave you a word at the end of that video. The word for this video is bananas. So there's only one word left, and that word is going to be in our next video, which is a huge, giant nail product haul that is huge. I don't even know if I've ever seen a haul this big ever on any nail product channel. I've been waiting days to do this. And while I'm filming this, I have more packages trickling in, which means we're going to have to do another haul. All right, guys, I hope you like this video. Remember what the word is. Make sure if you want to be part of that giveaway that has over a hundred dollars worth of products that you subscribe to my channel. Let me know you subscribe in the comments. And second, DM me that secret phrase. Make sure that you don't put it in the comments because you are competing against 75 other people to win this giveaway. And if you give that phrase to everybody, that means you're just going to increase or decrease rather your odds of winning. So if you're watching my videos, you're liking, you're subscribing, you deserve that giveaway. So make sure you send it to me privately. So, so far, today's word or this video's word is bananas. All right, everyone. Love you. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see y'all later. Bye.